Yes, welcome to Keep the Ball Game! East Slends! Couldn't believe How are you, East Slends? You know me well. the nickname in the world, that, innit? We just, we just got our ass handed to you, sir. No, you can't, you can't. We'll say who, but mate. we just played. No, 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 we'll no. We could play to the tennis, it was a bad bad day for open goal. It's like playing against a fucking budgie, so you wouldn't shut up, man. I don't know. Was it good, though? Oh, incredible. It's the best I've ever seen, that. Like, nah. Yeah, have you played here, me, man? This is good. <laughs> <laughs> this, is where, this is your usual seat, I'm down in the stand, watching. Right. No, you. I, do you know what? I, I don't know if I've ever told I think I may have told you when I was 10, I, was, I scored the, the halfway time challenge. Did I ever tell you something? Oh, you dribble to the words of the one. Ch- 10 seconds. The slides in the crowd. He would have been there. I right? think we should do that in the SPL for. Not the SPL, but that should be the new penalty shootout. I think MLS, that's what he used to do in MLS. I seen Jesse Mars actually scored one like that. My arm there for you, man. Is that what he done? Uh-huh. I didn't see, I just heard that he done that. Sorry, man. I don't think there's a player in world football that's got a worse record than me, and I swear to God. I've lost 85 Scottish Cup finals. Uh, have you, have you ever lost? Shoot the wee man. What? We might be shooting shadows. What, eh? If you want to win a final, you need to play against me, innit? Ah, exactly. <laughs> I need to play against fucking Sai. Martin Dill was changing with Martin Dill. He was like, I went to him with Dave Ashton. Uh, if I'll tell you both after it. <laughs> oh, good He's been good weekend. Good, aye. Big man's fucking. Wait, like, well, came back 18 year old. How young do you look, innit? I don't know. A big cowboy, innit? Big John Dutton. Yeah, no, no, it's unreal. fucking. Had a haircut, then I was like, that's it. Mrs. Boy, I say this to him every week and I lie, but I'm being serious, that's the best I've seen you, dude. I know, my Mrs. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> <laughs> my Mrs. Boy, my new top. You need to snap all the time. I'm alright. She's a. Uh, Where is it for? What sort of. I don't know, is it Ar- Ar- Arn- Arn- Arnie? Arnie? Arnie, yeah, Arnie Colin. You look like Big Arnie Schwarzenegger. <laughs> <laughs> He's an Arnold Schwarzenegger, come on. No, I can't do that. You've got to, you've no doubt for ages. I'm not doing any. I need your boots and your boots and what? What did he say? Gloves your boots and your motorcycle. He's promised us a cowboy, did he? Oh, so he does? He did, I can, mate. That's fucked. Throat's gone. Oof. Oof. I'll do that next week. There's only one thing that'll make you feel better, a wee bit of yoga. (laughs) (laughs) I know. I know. Did you get that off your uncle? At all? <laughs> My God, you changed the service. <laughs> he leaves orange. How was your wedding, mate? Because three days, come on, it's been like... Made an arse at Miss Nights, but good, you? good, mate, I have. That's what I can't... I need to stop drinking whiskey. I always send us an alone attack, man. Okay, but what we got to say to him? It's just every week, isn't he? Aye. Uh, it's just a real man, I'm half a drink. He's half a drink every week. He's back on it the week after. No, it's just Get his shirt out of trouble. He's fed up everybody. Uh-huh. But he'll rise up again. He'll be back. Nah, he'll be back. But how is the best Nobody man? gets the fear like me, mate. <laughs> Honestly, I've had three... I've had f- f- Saturday, I woke up with the fear. Sunday, I woke up with the fear. Monday, I woke up with the fear. No, it's the worst though, because you're not getting another drink to get it away for you. <sighs> but you I, I don't know, even get to see me and my brother are nearly rolling about with each other outside the village hotel Friday night. <laughs> about what? Fuck this. You would take him, wouldn't you? You had the bigger dick or something. He's fucking up. He won, obviously. You best man? <laughs> no. My be- one of my, be- was my, my best, two best mates. I uh, was getting married, one was the groom obviously and one was the best man. How is he speak? So you're not, you're not their best mate, but no, your best mate. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, his speech was good actually, all the speeches were good. Have you ever done, have you asked that? Have you ever done a best Free bar mate. I have, I. You got a free bar? That's, that's how much dough they've got. That's the worst that's for you. Free bar mate. You, you don't need that. That's why you made a milk cut, cut and arse sort of it. I've been fucking costing you money up there in Edinburgh, you wouldn't have had half a drink you had. Uh, 100%. But brilliant. Weddings, I love weddings. I, love I, do, weddings. I hate weddings. I know. See that middle bit is so boring. I've got well, to that point. go away for that pictures and that. Oh, I've got to that the point. most awkward conversations you have to have with people. Mm-hmm. Oof. Pretend no you me. like them. Oof. <laughs> no for me. I've that. got to that point where you're counting doing who's left to get married, innit? Uh, ah, your mates, your mates. Aye, her brothers. Her brother just got engaged last week, so that's one to look forward to. Andy's still got married. That'll be the wedding of the year, mate. Slay needs to get married. Andy's just a one, innit? Aye. Where is that going to be, you don't mind me asking? Uh, st- I don't know if I want to say. No, I don't want to say no yet. Well, you'll know, you'll know, you'll know when it gets booked. Hi, it's been, it's it's the, it's loud and 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 yeah. I'm actually so excited. Actually, I'm not just saying this. I think I'm going to become the best coach in this country. Good. And I don't mean. And I don't we slings. <laughs> we slings on the laptop. And I don't mean. I don't mean in a few years. I mean now. I, I've actually sussed something out. I, I, I keep. Well, I watched the, the the games back all year round. Keep watching them, watch them, and I've just seen what probably everybody would see, like bad miss, bad cross, whatever. But I've sussed something out, and also I've sussed Ange 
his final part of his football, which makes it as good as what it is. I've sussed out how that works and I'll show you. But so the night of the morning night or the night, sorry, when we're training, I'm going to take the boys through that. Take it through the clips and then we'll get the training pitch. Who's yeah. training the night? I work on it. Well, it'll What's be uh, Tuesday when this goes out. Uh, oh, have you ever seen a coach on? peel his own nose on a podcast? <laughs> He slains it. That's a great show. What's the clip about on, East? Paul? What, mate? What's the, what, what game is it on for the clips? So it's half time warm up. Just the, the, the Marondo at the start, they only. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it's the, the last game, but I, I actually watched back. I've got other clips for the other games as well, but we actually, no, there's not a lot. Our boys are really good, but it's just a. So, what, so how are you going to start it? What's your, you, is, are you going to do an opening? Like, I give him a bit at first, or is it just like the sewers just straight in the clips? No, there'll be a wee, wee opening, but um, do you practice that? Have you done it before? No, no, I'll tell you right now, it's never right. No, I do you know what I, I think, but when you when you're your first one anyway, I think when you're doing something, you know what you're going into doing, you're confident in what you're doing it for, then I think it's much better. As when some hoffy thing I got taught, I don't know what I'm going to say. That's when you're all when you've got a reference point, you mean? So, yeah, reference uh-huh. point, and you know what you're trying to do. So, I think I'll be a bit of gym low on the laptop, mate. That's the only worry. I was going off my touch. Joe Lemon party. We, we, <laughs> we, 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 who was it against? Rangers it was. No, it was still in uni. I was going off my nut. Still in uni, I'm fucking, I, I'm losing it with a clip. And I was like, put the next clip, Jim, on. He puts on the wrong fucking clip, didn't he? No, what was it? He put something like that, wasn't it? Two goals getting off each other. Get two goals <laughs> getting off each other. That little ass, man. We got up. He couldn't have cl- cl- clicked on, couldn't have clicked on the thing, could he? But bro, his on the big screen, we could see where the mouse was, and the mouse was like right beside where he had to click, but on his screen, he couldn't see it. You're like, fucking move it across. <laughs> but what were you, but Kev, 8-0 the one at the weekend. Aye. Taking over, mate. 8 0. Apparently, the other team, our, our parents were raging because why are you playing a team like this? They're too good. Wow. That's a compliment. Taking it to the next level, aren't you, mate? Fucking hell. Unbreal. Taking over. And we still have got big games to come. That's why we'll get judged. We play the gear. The West of Scotland's cancelled on us this weekend. Oh, all right. That was your thing or two. You took, the, you took the other team this week? I took the other boys, the intermediate boys. They were uh, 6 2 winners against Roseville. Hey, so hey. team cancelled for the No, we've, we've got Why don't you keep the Boca boys in there one night just to see what they do? No, we don't do it. Did he do. come in and watch you too? <laughs> Shadow you. <laughs> and then another, another wee phone call on Friday night, a couple of players. Is that? Danny on the move. Your keeper, your boy. No, we're not going we're not going to the one way. The other one way. We're going the other way. Oh are yeah. you? Yeah. Is the other way East End. Get wow. something to do with the, the, the guy he played to head the tennis with now? No, oh, going, no, no, he's in there, but we're going to we're going to Wednesday. Mate, that's brilliant. Good, Danny. Is he? But then I got a report mate. back for Hearts as well. Wow. They were at the game Saturday, and he says, "Kev, uh, watch your game today. Very, very impressed with your boys. Uh, that's we need he's the best at the yo-yo test, isn't he? All right, we need to organise a friendly, <laughs> and uh, the boy at the back looks like he could chase jig for fun. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> the boy, the other goalie, Carter Stevens boy. Really impressed with him and goals as well. So two it's not good goals. when you, but they're good with their feet. That's what oh, it is, isn't it? Two of them good aye. with their feet. Are your boys chanting the moon, mate? I'd sit and watch him and push myself laughing. Hey. See when the boys doing the other end, mate. He's fucking swinging on the crossbar. <laughs> And I've, I've got to say, Saturday, Rossfield didn't have any shots and he's fucking doing pull ups on the ground bar. Yeah. And then well, they got, like got to a point where I was like, Danny, just concentrate. You need, Dad, I've got nothing to do. Tommy Bunch used to bring us here to play the national team like two nights before the. They get the Scotland games. Are they? Aye. Yeah. So we'd line up as the opposition. We were like the US Celtic youth team. What age is that? Celtic youth team, so what, 18, 19? Was it? Uh huh. And then he would pull you in, he would, he'd be on our team. Wow. And he'd be like, this, take this fucking serious. When we get it, keep it. Then I gave him it back. So he played left back for his first time. The ball went to him. Dan Fletcher came running to me, trying to nutmeg him. Fletcher took it off him and through and scored. <laughs> After he just went fucking, Matt, make sure you fucking keep the ball when. We see the coaching staff. He's in coaching staff. In Scotland. Tata made Darren Fletcher the first time he got the ball. That's the first time I came across Tommy Burns in Scotland. So what a guy he was, by the way. <sighs> My first ever time at Hamden was like the old Hamden when Scotland played Saudi Arabia. Was it that under what, sixteen World Cup? Fi- was it World Club final or something? That would be like. 1990 or 89, 90? Fucking hell, man. Hey, bro, you no, it was a school trip. Have you ever won for the family come to Scotland games? Yeah. Nah. You used to win, you used to win, I don't used to always go, I, every, every Scotland game, you're massive. I kind of fell away for a wee bit, but get, try to get back in it. See, on you were saying there about Darren Fletcher, see, he has two boys, he's got twins. Ah, one plays with England. Scotland, one plays with England. 
Mad, eh? Maybe, but they might be top. Oh, wait, aye. Have you seen that? Aye, I did notice that on the side there. <laughs> Wonder why he's grown that, eh? <laughs> what, and what's that for? Just a new look. New look, new style. You used, to the, you used to are fully getting into the tune of that manager and assistant. Grovener <laughs> <you? laughs> Sport fighting Tommy Fury. Aye, aye. Some result for Grovener at the weekend. What Beat fucking it? Man U 7 0. <laughs> what about them? Oof. Oof. Embarrassing. I know, but see, for a man, it just shows the frustration of management. Uh, for, uh, how, how could he predict that performance, mate? After how well they've been doing. I know. I've never seen a team like no try as much as that for 45 minutes. Like, sure. They literally did not try. Just gain up. Oof. I know. Why do you think that is though? Because he's obviously on them all the time. Why uh, would you just chuck it? He said that, didn't he, after the the game? He was like, I can accept like people not being at it, uh, having a bad game or whatever, but no sticking together, no trying, no running back. So Major changes needed. And he, one thing I'll say about him, he's, he's been fucking ruthless since he's been mm, a manager, I, manager I, so I wouldn't be surprised if it was... I think you might get rid of Fernandez next. Mm, uh, he maybe. would be the man. He does. I, I would get rid of him. Watch him live, mate. Did you see him asking to come off? When they were doing subs? Aye, he wanted to come off. No way. Mate, they took off Casemiro, Varane. No, Casemiro, Lissandro Martinez and Rashford. Right. And he, he was like, why man, I'm coming off? Right. When they're 6-0 yeah, down and he's the captain. Looks like Paul McGowan, didn't he? Yeah, he's kind of Paul McGowan. What do you think? What do you think? They told me to have Bruno Fernandes. It's like Paul McGowan. I thought he meant Lissandro Martinez. <laughs> what do you think? They told me Fury and I want you to fight Jake Paul. I'd take him. Jake Ball. Could be a battle there. I'd just drink some tip. Prime versus. That's what I'm saying. Aye, Prime well, versus. Uh, you know how serious this time. man takes his energy drink? I know. I picked him up with then he was drinking another fucking energy <laughs> drink. <laughs> just taste him. Just see how far they're at. See what the competition was like. Ah, I've seen the competition. I would take him. See if we could put a wee tweet in there just to see if he bites on it. Say something to him. No, no, my throat. What do you want to bite on? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll take, uh, take him definitely. No, are we going to move on to the football? Sit in the middle Kevin Kyle, come right to you, mate. I watched it. Oh, well done. Oh, well, <laughs> there we go. So <laughs> so well done. Thanks very much for that, mate. Can you ask me on any other games? <laughs> but Celtic, uh, fair play to sit down penalty. It's, the it's one of the ones, it. Simon, you see every week, by the laws of the game, it's a penalty. But is it a fucking penalty? Oh, the Greg Taylor one? Uh, what's he made? What's he made? Uh, the Kyogre one is obviously a talking point, but that's he stopped pulling him just outside the box, so I don't think there's anything in that. St Mirren did well. They looked, they looked defensively quite solid, quite yeah. compact. I think Celtic struggled on the left with Maida. I thought Maida had a poor game. Um, Jota was good. They did a lot of joy doing the right, but couldn't quite get the final ball right. And then, Do you know why, though? St Mirren had obviously worked on defending that right. back. Mate, see that? Right times the centre-half was in aye. that fucking area where the ball goes across. See the boy Charles Dunn? He was actually well. fucking really good. Well. Yeah, well. And the boy Small <coughs> at left back. Aye. Is it Small? Strain. No, no, it's no, small. Oh, no, small. It's right got, I'm saying I've got a small strain. <laughs> <laughs> no, Michael Hannah was good enough. As soon as you get that kills it though, did uh, it? It does. It's an but uh, the game's done. St. Man are very well set up though, nah. Yeah, yeah uh, off the ball, they're good. probably the one team I think in the league, them or Livy, you'd say that you don't want to go 1 0 down against. Doesn't matter who you are yeah. because. The game plan then just sat down. Is when they score goal? first or something that they've no, that they've no lost? They've, they've won, when they score first, they've won like nine games, seven games at home and drew two. Is that right? Some start. <clears throat> something like that. The home record. But I can see why. He always looks Oregon. raging on the side, Robinson. Then he looks yeah. like he's on them constantly, man. But they're, 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 they're decent, by the way, like decent in terms of the, the, the defensively, their shape and stuff, because Celtic did find it difficult. But even at Celtic part of the last time they played them, I don't know, I think it ended 5 1, but up until 75 minutes or something, they actually kind of had a go at it so and played well. Aye. He's good, doesn't he? Because when they sit in, it's not like they just sit in, they've always got an out ball, don't they? Yeah. A, they've got a plan in place when they win the ball back again. I think you need to hear that against Celtic. Aye, to be fair though, as much as we're saying that, the second half could have been 7 1. Mm. Easy. Can Even the first half of Celtic had a lot of, the ball in a lot of good areas, I, but just I, final ball. I, 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 I would agree with Kev, I don't think Celtic created that much no. up until the red card. I think Hattati hit the one with the bar. Hattati hit the bar and then the Jota 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 in the one on the right hand side. Uh, so I thought some of them were, were, were good, they were compact, they were making it difficult. But then second half, as soon as the, the uh, equaliser goes in, man, it's, it was the Alamo winning. Mm. Celtic could have scored. It just shows you when, the, when you're having that much possession and you're struggling to break it down, sometimes you're just needing something to kind of, something crap to happen. And that, that obviously the first goal with Jota was a bit of a scrimmage in the ball and he managed to get it through Trevor Carlton's legs and it's crept in, but, and then from that... But it's such an hand. advantage, so right, for first 45 minutes we fat, you're just going to bring a bad on who's <laughs> fucking desperate to come around and press and he, I thought he was brilliant when he came on. Just pace. on goal, oh, on goal, O'Reilly on goal. Go on, like, uh, just the thing with Abada is he's direct. I think that's what they needed. Somebody that just said, he's basically just said to him, get on there and get at him and make him put him on the back foot. And I think that's what because you could have brought on 
Hasbanovic, who's obviously I would say maybe better with the feet cutting in and cutting Such out, chopping, uh, chopping and stuff. But that slows everything down, whereas with a bad it was intended. You can see that every time they built up the play, it was always going out to a bad, out to a bad, out to a bad, where he was crossing it, getting to the byline, I think that's... And then when they got that second goal, which was obviously questionable because it's come off a... I would say he's headed on his own arm, Alistair Johnson. Right. Uh, it's yeah, ended, up, uh, it's ended up in the net, and then, but once that's second, man, he's quite good. Like, that boy Johnson, isn't he? That's the best I've seen him on the ball yesterday. I, I thought, thought he was quiet. Decision making was really good. Uh, he's, he, he was really, really uh, good. He kept coming inside quite a lot. Yeah. Um, this has got to be a record, by the way. I know goals. Aye, goals. Aye. I think it could 250 be right. and 99 appearances. I think this season, I don't know, I wonder what the record is for the end of the season, what a team scored the most. This is surely aye. going to be the season. This is, aye, this is. Got to beat it. I think somebody said that, like, if they're on pace for their average, you know, they'll beat it. Because it's like. And I, I think they still need to keep up nearly at an average of three a game. It's something like 62 what do you, Is plus. this to beat the record in Scotland? Uh, so that is I think what, somebody said to me, I could be rang here. We've got the stats many there. It's no, the football monitoring board. It has to be, board, it has to be Scotland, surely. It's not Sorry, the football monitoring board, board are getting off each other just now. I've got to ask him again in five minutes. <laughs> but supposedly... Jim Lowe on it now. <laughs> Jim Lowe's on it. Board. <laughs> but I think it's... Rod I could be rang here, but I think it's Rodgers' got the goals set the record for the goals scored scored in a league campaign he's got the 120 something maybe is that right I think Celtic are on 89 now or wow. something along the lines um, I think they'll beat that Monitor Board are saying 69 69 69 on <laughs> tell me to say 69 <laughs> um, did you know what about the penalty Greg Taylor that's a penalty one of the other ones of the game can but can what has he meant to do it's like he's half a yard away so it's harsh there's no intent there but uh, to be honest I think before the, the change of uh, law and pan balls, I still think last year that's a penalty. Do you? I, think, I still think it would be given. Well, because he's out. He's just because out he's out stretched. I, I agree, there's, there's no intent, you know what I mean? His hand's already there before it goes, but I think they just look at Graves going to get there on the other side. And just hearing the old, the old argument with VAR, like in the old days, he would say decisions even themselves out over the course of the season. When if you look at the Hearts penalty that Celtic should have had, Celtic should have got against Hearts at the beginning of the season. When the same thing was the body was at hand was stretched. And then they've got one the other way. Kind of like it does probably balance itself up a bit. See what's mad about that one, right? I think now when you look at them, there's been a few, right? Because at Hearts we should have got one against St Mun at St Mun, and then a week later St Mun should have got one against us at yeah. Tencastle. That one, that one. With Michael Smith at the start of the season at Ten Castle was mad now that you look at I mean, when you think That's about it, but how that right. wasn't a given. Based on every single one of them. Aye. But, well, not yeah. everyone, but 90% of them are gaining as penalty. So yeah. they say it all the time, but that is that is the frustration in it, where it's like consistency's no there in certain things, especially with fucking handball one. Have you seen the way Don Robertson does it? So every other ref goes and runs out, he's like Don Robertson's like that. <laughs> Did you see him? The Ross County again. That's yeah. more than that. Pink whistle in it too, man. It's last time I fucking check it. Andy, you go and play Celtic like Wednesday. Right. How'd you go about that? Just seeing how many goals are scoring. Didn't like that, did he? With Bobby Madden. Who? Oh, if you want to change the subject, get away. Uh, oh, he's like in corner. Right, let's go back play Bobby if he's mad. Eh. Mate, the women's last thing to go beat a park kids, so there's no actual asset blueprint of how to beat them. But you've got to just try and stick to the game plan as much as you possibly can. and my, my thing is, I think when you, you're no an old firm team and you're playing against the old firm, is I don't think you can win the game in the first half, but you can lose it. So, obviously, you need to like try and that. stick to the game plan as much yep. as best as you possibly can and then hope they start getting frustrated, start doing things that's not really natural to them, stuff that they've not done all season. But they, it's clear, you've seen it all season, they come out and try and blitz teams in the first sort of 15, mm. 20 minutes. So, I think for me, that is our most probably important period of the game is the first sort of 20, 25 minutes. And then, uh, I've seen but to be against fair, St. Johnson, you should try to play, like really play, overplay it when the one Fraser uh, plays in the midfield and it gets cut out. I, 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 I can't see his penalty. I, I, I still I think, I obviously, I'm not going to say how we're going to play, but I think we'll still try and play. Right. But there'll definitely right. be adaptations, option, yeah. adaptations to it. Brilliant, yeah. Andy. Like Great word. Tom really good. Back. Different class. But uh, see, to be fair, it's fucking kiss of death me saying this, but. <laughs> Some of some of your performances at Celtic Park's actually been no bad. Celtic have won them all. Like, don't get me wrong. There's a couple last, last year when you played at the league game and the cup game. Last year was one 0 Kyogo miles offside. Don't hear you complaining about that. Slain. Don't know if it was. I think the other one in the cup was three two. And is that where he gave it a goal second half? You uh, actually gave it a goal second and then half. And they, they battered us five one. I want to say four one or five one. And the the one in the split at Celtic Park. But listen. 
they're the, they're the best team in the country for a reason. It's going to be very, very hard no matter what. And then you've got them Saturday and on the Scottish Cup. So and we said as well Saturday. We've it's the games you want to be involved in. Aren't? If you're a St Mirren manager and Charles Dunn does that with that, oh, it must drive you insane. I think, Mr. Uh, see, for me, to play, see, see, should you just but see, that you know, that? right? That can happen. But see, when you've done it, don't why are you trying to drag him down? Like, a lot of it's still one each. I'll let your goal and try and make a save. You can't. But that's one of the ones where it's split second in it. Like, as soon as he's pulled him down, he stops. Yeah, that's what does that, doesn't it? So it's. It's just that that would be that, that, isn't it? Aye. Mm-hmm. You don't Kiel's see that, that he touches the game. Do. He doesn't have anything touches the ball, but he's just a layup. All That's all what you say. That is what we've said all season about him and Maeda, where, like, for as many goals and assists and that they've got, they are the trigger for them out of possession. Aye. Like, that is a, a nothing boy he's basically chased down. And for that, it's turned into a, a red card and a free kick right outside the box and basically changed the game for Celtic. So. They're so sharp on the press, they too, aren't they? So aye, there's aye, a man, least mental, touch, mate. Are you better? Mental. Can you fuck a bit, mate? Just. Just, just wearing your Doc Martens and booting it every <laughs> time it comes. I mean, I tell you something that's shooting, we'll go into the big boy at Dundee United. I don't look, my, my pity hating fit, we're going to go into it. My pity hating fit will ever be kids is when the boys getting put down and they just fuck out of the park. I hate it. Stop doing it, but the big man probably should have done it. Though. I know, but he doesn't, I don't think he needs to put it, he can kick it back up the pitch. Ah, yeah, <laughs> he lets it bounce eight times before he tries to get it. How was the game on Saturday? Us? Are you? Uh, first half, no great, to be fair. Jen yeah, Callum yeah. Davidson wearing specs, put his off. Uh, like, I, yeah, I don't know what's happening there. In a black leather jacket, <laughs> down to his knees. Big black boots. What did you <laughs> say was blasting for the dressing room? ACDC? Nirvana. It was weird. <laughs> <laughs> smells Nirvana. like teen spirit. <laughs> I looked at the teen room, Callum Davidson's like that. Just banging his head off his head. Uh, uh, no, I tell you what, St. Johnson, honestly though, St. Johnson were good first half. Like, um, what could done the highlights? I probably, I think if you look at St. Johnson, you you naturally think they are more direct, didn't they? They are played up to Stevie May, Steve May running behind, but they, they played some good football in the first half. Uh, we were probably fortunate to go in 1-0, but then we were a lot better in the second half. When you came on, wasn't it? No, before that. <laughs> Definitely before that. But, um, nah, Big boy, Moles is lucky, half. mate. He's off six, that's a red card as well, isn't it? Oh, aye, 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 Gino, Gino's record so against St Johnston, mate. Hates him, didn't he? He hates Callum Davis. He hates that. 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 He is the one new team that like is that like always does that in games. Stretches it for his runs and mine's always a threat. He's rapid. So him and Shanks have been a good foil for each other. Yeah. Are we going to go and watch any sunset Wednesday? Wednesday, I can't. Oh, you're training, aren't you? I'm going no, to, I'm no training. I'm going to take Danny out of wherever I need to go to. I, um, I would like to oh, go. Oh, you see you're ditching the other ret- 10 just for your end, boy, right? No, no, I've got that covered. Good lad. Good I've lad. got the end, my Wednesday plan. I'm going to. Uh, yoga. Y- yoga and then PSG and. What's I- you pay for a yoga session? Yoga session? Uh, if you check, probably it'll be about 30 quid or something. Yeah, hey, I know. It's obviously, Celtic the favourite. It's a game at Celtic. Is that Parkhead? He's slain on the yoga, eh? Is oh, it Wednesday? Go. Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, surely they're taking Danny there to sign that. I don't, don't <laughs> the you the the at half time. Don't you <laughs> Swinging for the goal, but. Uh, Tony the, the Glenn, I could just go straight after that. I'm sure Andrew sorts out with the tickets. Are you happy with that, Tommy Sheridan? He's a goalie coach. He's a goalie coach now, isn't he? There'll be nobody wanting your tickets in your family. I don't think you get any for away tickets for. I'm, I'm going to come and watch that. So, I think I might go I'm and watch it. You in the box, the di- director's box? Me and Boydie. So you've no came to watch me once, but when it's at Celtic Park, you'll come, aye, that's for me. Come and watch it, don't you, Ed? Charlie, I've seen you times this year. I've seen you times this year. You're, you're a good supporter, big man. You've seen you times this year. I've seen you near times that I saw Brumel. There's no fucking reason why, isn't there? No, play for about six months. I know. Again, every six weeks. I'm not a chance you're having a game, though. Mate, it's the weirdest. We did 40 Saturday, by the way. We did six games in two weeks, and then we didn't have a game for three weeks. Who is it Saturday? Trinidad. Uh, Trinidad. Tough game, to be fair, they're doing well, aren't they? Nah, the Saints got sent off the last game we did, didn't they? Aye. Nah, that's alright. Aye. Yeah, I know. After my video analysis, we'll be alright. Aye. I know, uh, Absolutely. obviously, Celtic are favourites for the two of them, and they're going to expect to win, but if you had to pick one game that you would want to see Celtic win, Wednesday, if you had to pick one game that you I want to win Wednesday, I want to win Saturday. Saturday or day. Saturday. Saturday or day. Saturday. Saturday. Right. Nah. It's a must. Saturday, it'll be a right hard game Saturday. Think has won it. Saturday. Aye. Cup. Oh, that's L- a tough game. That's a tough L- game. L- kick-offs, tough Is it tough? See if I was Robbie Nielsen, I would play, I would play, I would bluff on Wednesday night. What do you mean? They're sort of mental. Death. 
And then, cha- and then change it on Saturday. Aye. Trick him. Decoy. Trick my gang. Go a two six. Sure, that'll do Ange. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> aye, two six two. Uh, <laughs> two six two. That's what I'll do. Aye, right, we're on the Rangers. They acted aye. well at last week's cup. Fans would have been a bit nervy going into it, but. Actually, we, we, after the Cookman show the other day, I actually thought there was a big overreaction on Bill. I do. If he did it. No, if he, <laughs> <laughs> no just beat everybody. I, I think, because you're the man of that game. Um, you mean you lose against Celtic in a cup final, it's always going to be. But I think when you forget why Bill came in in the first place, where Rangers were at, they were mm. nine points behind, they were miles behind Celtic, where obviously that's why they changed the manager. Um, and obviously you need to win cup finals against Celtic, I know that, but in the January transfer window, that's not a window where you can get everybody out and lots of players in. So uh, you do need to give Bill, because I, I always say that was Bill trying to show But I think he deserves criticism when you see Raskin and Cantwell's oh, performance. I, on the game, I think on the game, you, you, you've got to talk about what's happened in the game, the decisions made, but I just think overall, I think, that there has been an overreaction to it a wee bit um, from for, for, uh, for Rangers fans. No o- fair on me. Bale, I'd, I'd agree with you. Aye. aye, on Bale, definitely. Because um, as I said, when he's came in, they are miles behind and it's going to be in the summer. Because my argument always was, was it, is it the right time to come into Rangers? Because people are saying, aye, because he's got his time to get players out. But at Rangers, that doesn't happen. You need to win every game. So like the cup final, people will criticise you. People will hammer you if you don't win. So I always think maybe coming in the summer, you might not get that chance. Um, but the fans, I think, are... No, listen, I know. But they are going to be... They're on them at the moment. I think. They are on yeah, them. Right. certain things. Um, Do you think it's a bit harsh, Kev? When you're playing with the big, the big clubs, Celtic Rangers, you're, you're always going to expect criticism, even though we may sit here and think it's harsh. The reality is that at a big club, there's demands and there's expectations, and if the, the, the manager can he bring the team to those standards of demands, then he's going to get criticised for it. Ultimately, sometimes I think I, I, I go to my own experiences when I was younger. I used to get in front of the media and play my Scotland, and speak too much, say too much. And it always came back and bit you in the bum. Whether it was sitting talking about the Faroe Islands mm-hmm. and then fucking going all the fishermen, blah blah blah, and then we draw two two. Who they're getting slagging off? It's me, well. Bill sometimes I feel talks too much about everything, and the fact he said about the two boys, I'm I'm signing starters, and then no Disney start them. Well, you've got to take criticism that's because right. that's how it is. So sometimes maybe just tone it down a wee bit in the media, and that way you don't give yourself too much to be thinking about. But definitely the fact that. Um, but then the, the, but the Van Bronck has got criticised because he never said enough. He never so. said enough, enough, but that's football. You can only be yourself. Really. That's the kind can, of guy he is. Saying he's made a really good point. The fact that when you come in in January, you're you're signing players that are maybe not wanted by other clubs, maybe know the top target. You can't get players. It's hard to get players. It's hard to get. Your, it's hard to get the top top boys in January. Um, you're basically getting guys that are maybe come to the end of their contract or no playing at a club. No playing at a club. So I think. Bill, as long as he can continue this type of form, and he's got two old firms, which can be if he was to go and win the next two old firms and say Celtic still win the league, Rangers fans would look at that and think, wait a minute here, he's come in and won majority of points, we've drew with Celtic, we've maybe beat Celtic, we've lost a cup final. I'd be quite happy with that, thinking, right, let's get a cup of players in the summer. That means ah, it's progress. That, that being said, though, as much as that, you said something about Raskin and Cantwell, they were excellent on Saturday. Mm. Aye, so Cant- that's Cant- what Cant- I think the criticism is fair. Aye. Aye. That's what it is. Oh, fair. no, I think the criticism on his team selection in the game is yeah. definitely fair. Yeah. But in the bigger picture, it's not fair because he's still won, what's that now, 14 out of 15? Aye. Uh, aye. Leading up to the cup final and beating them and then the cup final. He deserves criticism because I probably Cause he gave, it's a fair argument he got the team wrong. Um, can't we win but see, Phil, what I would say is that I think even before January, I thought I think Rangers should have enough in their squad to beat Kelly and St Johnson. Yeah, I'd agree with that. All the teams that so the finals against Celtic that is where you're measured. The, what's your recruitment be like? Are you getting closer? Is this new manager getting more into beating Celtic who you've not beat? Uh, when was last time you beat Celtic? Was last year at home, the Highlander. No, was it cup? Was it cup this? Oh, the semi, semi, final, semi yeah, yeah, yeah. Cup, I So I mean. There's still a long way to go, don't get me wrong. Uh, but you've got to beat what's in front of you. And I thought first half especially is probably the best they've played at Ibrooks um, mm-hmm. for a period of time. Tempo was really second good. Half, yeah, could have been up much more. For what i seen the second half, then they look Can they get a few again. chances, didn't they? Uh, I, but I, I, I was speaking to a few people there, they said the Rangers almost dropped half in the second half. Did dropped half and almost let Kamal have the ball. I did, I did listen to it on the radio um, and the, 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 the boy that was at the game was saying that Come on, like Derek McKenzie gave him a right, must have given him a wrong because they've came out a, a better team in the second half. And obviously, the penalty for me, that's questionable. Oh, again, what's the, what's the boy meant? How's he meant? I bet it's not going to touch what, that. What do they call him? Can he see? Even in the VAR, know how many times it goes back. 
Where the puts is it hit his hand? Like I know it's hit up here, but that's a very that's, that's there's sure, not enough yeah. there's not enough conclusive evidence mm. to suggest that that's a penalty. So to go that's to the bar and then give it, you got if you've got a doubt. You can't even be giving it because it's like it's a goal. It's Ryan a... Kent's in front of the ball, so he can't judge where that ball is going. He thinks Ryan Kent's going to control the ball. Ryan Kent misses the ball and it hits. But that's the, that's not the controversy for me because that like he, he puts his hand out, so if it hits his hand, it's a penalty. But see the 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 replays it shows because it's the no, t-shirt line in it. It doesn't show. It does. You can't no tell if it's under enough. the no, t-shirt. Yeah, yeah. Line for the angle, another one that never I mean? got given. That was. Aye, that so same it looks as if it could easily have hit here. Yeah. There wasn't really many other angles, which. Because I remember at the start of the season, they says that, I can't remember how many English Premier League's got, but it's more, but every stadium's got five angles. But you only seen one, didn't well, you? We've only well, I've only seen one. I don't know if you've seen more, but... No, two, sorry. You see the one from behind the boy, and then you see the one from behind the goal. So, I don't know if they've if they seen other angles that sort of showed it was lowered in the arm. I'm not too sure. Okay, we've got a man that knows, well, how many angles do you get to see? <laughs> Few angles, wasn't it? <laughs> standard, standard penalty. Really. One for looking down. One remember, for the, remember the angle Motherwell showed we say like one time it was a way okay, we <laughs> say like part. So like, back. Was that the one with the scribbles across the line? It was zigzags. Okay, made that up, didn't they? Uh-huh. But I tell you about uh, Rangers. I, I'm right in saying they're playing Hibs on Wednesday. Yes, in form Hibs. Oof. Hibs look great. Is that Easter, Easter Road? Why now? Is that Easter Road? Uh, Easter Road. I tell you what, that could be a tough game. But that, that I think that's the type of game that a team that's in form. Really, like Lee Johnson, think about that game against Aberdeen with Jim Goodwin. That was like a do or die for both the managers. And since then, he's uh-huh. just went up, 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 and they're still. He's, cha- he's made big changes in the team. See, when I seen their team sheet Saturday, didn't well, the right? boy up front, the boy that played on the, the boy that was. Hope 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 And then the boy that scored the David couple of goals. The boy that scored the couple of goals. You will, you will. He's been having his best player. You and you and you and Cameron. You Cameron. For me, he's been having his best player. He's, he's sharp, isn't he? Second or third highest assist in the league. Uh, scored a few goals. I think he's always looked dangerous. So that could be a great um, game. He's been good. Could be goals. It could be See goals and that. That's probably the games that maybe rain. Like rain no disrespect to Kamalnik because I've been in these games, but Rangers always take care of Kamalnik. I've never really known Kamalnik going to Ibrox and getting too many points. Steve in the Clark's last. team did. To be did fair, they, I, they, they, I know they did at Rugby Park. They, they, no, they what, what, at Rangers no, a few times. A couple of results. I remember oh, Chris Burt scoring one in the last minute for a draw. Um, there was definitely a couple because I was I was a part of at least one of them. I can remember. I know they beat Rangers one. a few times at Rugby Park that year. That it kind of capitulated Clark, a wee bit. Mm. Um, but no, I just think that Rangers always like Andy said earlier. Rangers are expected to beat like your Kamal, like your Aberdeen, your Hibs, your Hearts and stuff like that. But this will be a tough test. You think Hibs, Hibs might go? I seen Nisbet came under really well. You think they might go two up with Nisbet? Remember they done? Remember they, they did know, that home? They did that home? Didn't they? Direct. Aye. Remember it was how many was it? Was it against Rangers? Aye. Aye. But was it two up? Sands and Lundstrom were playing at the back, weren't they? And they went. I think it's a. I actually think it's a massive game for both teams. Rangers obviously because the pressure they need to win every game, but. Hibs with the form they're on, uh, obviously looking to, to go as high as possible they can in the league. If they win that game, and so it's a massive for the minute. Lose, if Hearts were to lose to Celtic, it's two points between the two Edinburgh teams for third. Yeah, wow. Do you think both teams will go for it? Uh, of course, yeah. I, I think both will. I think... I well, Colac think... play again, will you go with Colac again? Aye. Aye. He was actually right. really good, aye. He was actually right. Good hold-up play, good link-up, uh, laying off he some good balls in the box. didn't he? Set up Sakari, also set up uh, somebody else for a shot. Who was that? But no, Korak's all right, but Morelos is one of them that's like, everybody's got an opinion of him now. And until that scenario sorted out, whether he's coming to go and stay. I tell you, it was a disgrace though, come on up school, being out of the stand. He's an absolute shambles. What was the goal? I don't know, I'm just trying to do this thing so he does have to be <laughs> <laughs> What about the penalty? Was it a penalty, McGregor? McGregor? Aye. Uh-huh, probably was a penalty. Aye, I would say that was a penalty. Yeah. Definitely. So you think about it, if you get that first penalty decision right, it's come on to get the other penalty. Might have been a closer game, what you think? Should have been 4-3 to Kamala. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> <laughs> or four or five. Can't buy me the boy Cap, was really good. He done well. He's That's really good, Tim. Sharp. That's exactly what it is. A lot of energy. Um, really good Looks in the boys. Looks forward well. a lot, which but is I, I, one thing I noticed. I thought when he signed, I don't know what I'm at, um, memory of Norwich, I thought he was more like a, a tenant that would come to feet a lot of the time. and. Didn't have that speed. He looks. He looks if he can get up and down the pitch. Uh-huh. In the areas he looks. Um, oh, he's a young boy, isn't he? He should be able to. A hundred percent. Aye, he gives you a hell of a lot of energy. So, I but I think the front players are better. I only watched the highlights, but the amount of times Raskin plays the boys through the lines into the front player. Aye, aye, front so players. That makes a difference. Rangers have. I always think when it's Jack yeah, or some, it's yeah, side, it's side, side to side. It's mundane. It's a bit like, oh, here we go again. It's predictable. 
But see, you know, he wants to run with the ball at yep. times, didn't he? And uh, attack your space. Did Bill so. not say something about selling his money or something? First. But is that comment again? Well, you've obviously seen it, so t- didn't no, ask I, us. I what wasn't. We said. It was something to do. Yeah, I think Ginger Bulls on the table and tell us what we said. So Ginger Weasley's will put his balls in the line. <laughs> but I, no, I'm sure somebody said to me that. Who? Who said to you? Just say what you've heard, you've seen. I see it myself. I did. Bill came out and said that whoever spends the most in, in any league will come out and tap every year, meaning Celtic spend the most, so they should come and tap. Now, when I first heard that, I went, like, no, listen, Michael, stop that. Wrap that because co- concentrating your in team just not you can't control it now. But at the same time, maybe he's trying to get uh, wine shell to up a wee bit. Maybe he's trying to, maybe he's trying to call it, which I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind if that was the well, case. But if someone else came out and said Rangers got a bigger wage, but again, it could be just one of the pictures well? on Twitter. I wouldn't surprise me oh, if, Rangers like had a, if, had a, if Rangers had a bigger wage bill. That would surprise me would 100%. It? Don't know, I don't know, because it's not surprising. No, no, I used to chuck wages. That's this guy right here. He's got a bigger budget. He'll know. He'll know. His wages are bigger. It's tight. It's pretty tight. Tight. Oh, it's tight. No, but that's not what we're talking about. That's not what we're talking about. They're not talking about the budget when I was saying it was tight. No, we're asking about the budget. Listen, from experience. By the way, do you know what? I generally don't know. Good. See, generally though, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter because teams with lesser budgets have won leagues and cups before. It happens in other leagues. Take a look at Chelsea. Definitely. Spent fucking. No, oh, yeah, they've got the biggest budget fucking in the world. Fucking in one uh, window and still fucking sitting nine uh, to ten to the table. And by the way, your budget's big enough to fucking compete, compete well in the win finals or whatever. It's like, so it's like in Edinburgh Hearts. So should the managers biggest budget in there sitting I don't think above Hearts. Ha- here's a, I don't okay. think Hearts have got a, the third biggest budget in the league. Oh, oh I think they do. Aberdeen will be up there. I think Aberdeen will be up there. Dundee United. Dundee United get fucking Melon Reigns on the Well, how much are you on? I mean, not telling. No, by the way, Aberdeen, mate, Aberdeen, mate, Aberdeen will be on our. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, Listen, I'm making it wrong. They signed boys for the champ, uh, but the boys Stuart for Wickham champ. I, 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 I remember. I remember when I spoke what? to Aberdeen like a long time ago, and Mark McGee says we'll give you 150 grand a year. So what's that? Three grand a week. I think that, that was. That, I thought that was quite good. Yeah, that'd be good. But I tell you what, Livy's got the best budget per point. Point. Oh, I. No, just now they've no mate. Ah, true actually. Since that interview we done. Since that interview, since you had that interview, you just go in for me. We've put, on back, in, we've put a target on his arse. Since actually, but since Bartley, since Bartley left. Since Bartley left. Mm. Aye, oh, so what so you're, saying, you're saying Christoph Beres fucked it? No, I said wasn't. Bartley should get the Livingston job. He should be the manager. <laughs> and He's always sticking up for coaches, isn't he? Clean the side, he picked up big time. <laughs> he loved Beal when he was a coach, know. Well, didn't he? <laughs> loved Beal when Gerard was there. So was a right hand man, <laughs> No, no, That's not a bad trick, though. No, I listen, I don't hate things like that. I just it's not obviously Marvin that's... Better. Oh, Christoph, it's the other boy that promoted for the youth. Uh, Stephen, Cre- uh, Stephen Craney looks like, didn't he? Uh, 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 Stephen Craney's turned uh, off. Oh, Craney? no, Neil Hastings. I played him. I played him for the youth. Ah, great Hastings guy. Hastings' fault. He was the um, Gala Faraday manager. Oh, was he, right? But, you know, why do you think Livingston have dropped off a wee bit for his task? Don't know. Do you know what? I'm going for a new What a goal that is by him. For a week. It should be big enough. Just to be fair. I think the last four have been Celtic Rangers, Aberdeen at Pitodre, and then Hibs at home. I'll be honest, some, some of the goals they've and... lost are shite. Uh, some of the goals they've lost are not good. Do you know what? I, I, I couldn't understand but, 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 the, the, watching that game, uh, Livingston. It looked like Livingston, uh, Hibs kept getting behind. But you I never, love it up your high line. You've never seen that. I thought that Because Manning, they'll keep going like, one ball keeps, keeps beating oh, it. Was that. One, one ball. ball. One ball. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you, wouldn't, you never ever see that about Livingston. No, they're right. always hard to break through. So maybe they've changed their style a wee bit. What, they're maybe going a wee bit more attacking? It just seemed to have the Christoph been goal. taking the centre half, is that what you think? That's probably what it is, isn't it? <laughs> I've seen a few times he tried to, I mean, I, I hate it, but I've seen a few times the defence try to play offside and they broke through the goal, the first goal comes Nicky, uh, was it Nicky tried to do it? No, it wasn't Nicky. Nicky did, was. Nicky did, <laughs> <laughs> Nicky did actually. And there was another one in the second half, they tried to play offside the right. half. Or maybe that was just Aye. a game plan for Aberdeen because they've got pace up top, they're drifting. No, it was Hibs, bro. Aberdeen were playing with United. They won the day they came playing that man. Cut that bit out. Cut that bit out. Why the fuck did I think it was Aberdeen? Was he one of them one at the sender off? Well, it's a definite sender off, isn't it? Oh, it's a sender off. Oh, Dave. Oh, Dave. But I've, I've never really seen Hibs play that under John Snyder. Quite direct and behind. Mixed it up quite well, plenty of feet, and then Maybe they noticed turning them. teams quick. They may have to change it because obviously they've got a for every single team runners in behind. Our 20s and your first team are fucking the perfect example because right. we don't do it enough. Right. 20 passes to go on it. Yeah. Aye, fucking unbelievable Listen. for fucking one box to have really. <laughs> Did Martin do actually stick your finger right up? Mate, he said it was a joke but he looked raging to me. So what actually, did Martin, was it Davey Marshall that shouted there? 
I'll only just read the thing, yeah. I've never actually seen it, aye. I've done that, didn't he? One minute. Did you actually do that? No, I have. Because you know something like. How many minutes were added on or something, man? He was like, one. And he got sent after it. Was there not something that like that? That's so petty, right? Do, do, you know how, do you know how pathetic sports scene after the blood at his finger, mate? <laughs> 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 Who's going to be sitting there like... Is that for you? I just fucking seen that. He's Sunderland, man. He didn't want that. He's Sunderland. Blow that. Could you hear that? Blow that. You are not showing that. Not at that time. Fucking blood it. Before the watershed, you're not showing it. What time is that? Eight o'clock or something? What's he doing, Dodd? <laughs> What's he doing? No, it's like why is he got a sporting blood finger? Midnight. <laughs> sporting no late half a living, isn't it? Couldn't have believe the blood of his finger at me. <laughs> Who'd they got offended at a finger? Fuck she did. Fucking hell, that's terrible, isn't it? <laughs> Incredible, man. Came from Sunderland, that sporty of. He could ease a man to man, don't it? Uh, man. That is a legend. I like you need you, that man. character. Every, he, he, he's always raging after a game as well, isn't it? Aye. Nah. Not in the game. 4 1, Davey. <laughs> man, isn't it? <laughs> Who's the maddest manager you've seen on the touchline? Oh, Lenny. Stevie Robinson's up there. Right up there. Stevie Robinson? Nah, what, when you play against? Stephen Robinson, uh, right, definitely. I noticed that in the centre game yesterday, mate. Constantly on, boys. Aye. I remember when he was a Motherwell manager, they had a boy in the middle of the pitch for him, boy. I think I told us. And uh, the full pitch, the full game, all I heard was him shouting this boy's name, and it was like, you know, like that Aaron Partridge fucking. Dan! Uh, Dan! 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 <laughs> Dan! Dan! That's what he was doing. I was like, fucking shut up. Like, this guy must have been fuming, man. It was playing, but he's definitely right up there. Is he? But see, Moga. Moga, so see, see, at Middlesbrough, when I used to play left back, Moga used to shout and tell you what pass to play. No, no. And it no. used to fucking no. drive me mad because it was like, see if it's a pass, for example, I'm no fucking. Ronaldo, see if it's a pass I've not seen. Like it's a fucking reverse into the middle of the pitch or something. I'm looking at my winger and he's shouting, get the fucking centre mid. You're playing a pass that you've not seen. Do you know what I mean? Because you're going to get away. That, that split second he's made you change your mind. Oh. Neil Walmart was nuts in the touchline. We're in fucking <laughs> London. You see that <laughs> one? Brilliant. Do you know what I right? mean? It's, it's his fucking fault. It's fucking his fault. <laughs> his name, who was that? Uh, Muscat. Right. Muscat. See, in terms of managers, there's a manager that's taken two games in the last three weeks and been scudded 4 1 twice. I've done the two poker? No, uh, I've took the so the last two. Oh, the bounce game. Two bounce games. Aye. Two bounce games in a week. What's happened, Paul? Tuesday, Tuesday, we done two bounce games and I get beat four one twice. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm, see after that, I'm I was like, at, see, I was at one of them. Watch one of them. My bad. His team, bad like, I, the his, team his team did get battered. The Why one I watched. Do you get to pick your team or do you, are you given? I just mixed them. Matty mixed. McDonald actually picked the team. Have a mix then. <laughs> see when we what? pick teams, I ask the kids right like a, a question. I ask them what they're studying at school. So like the, the last week was fractions and then the one was geography. I says, right, we'll ask you some geography questions. Whoever gets the two questions right becomes the captain. Name a country begins with B. Somebody shouted out Benmark. Fucking <laughs> 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 Benmark. I says, right, you're the captain. That's <laughs> uh, incredible. Here's one. What's the, cap what's the capital of Denmark? Copenhagen. Oslo. Copenhagen. Oslo's not. I'll tell you what I will say about you for that bounce game. You were brilliant with the younger boys. Very good. Hey. Hey, tell that to the chairman when you when you <laughs> when he's asking you why you're getting beat four one. So you try to try to get the big <laughs> Bring the young boys up. <laughs> no, well, but, uh, anyway, so, somebody told me Robin Nielsen's. He's a bit tasty, Robin. Uh, tasty on the touchline. I like a PC. I like a PC him. I think he's the fourth official. I like a PC him. Yeah, as he likes likes having like, the fourth officials must fucking. Hate oh, mate, imagine cards. being the fourth official. I feel sorry for the fourth officials. They've done the fuck. They've done fuck. I don't know what they meant to do. It's a guy on the pitch doing it. He gets a, the fourth official gets, gets absolutely everyone. slaughtered, Aye. man. What about playing against any managers that you always remember? Neil, anyone knew? Lenny. Uh, Lenny was. What he? Oh, he was terrifying. Uh, it was one of them you were terrified to go on because you're thinking, what will he be saying about me when you're on there? Do you know what I mean? Aye. But he was on everybody. He was on the other team as well with Ref. Can't really think of fucking others, man. You were scared to laugh on the bench when Lenny was the manager because he turned around and caught you, didn't he? Love computer tap, didn't he? Ah, you tap. Fucking Get tart. Get on, Lenny, you tap. <laughs> <laughs> I used to love him comment, but... <laughs> what a guy. Can you back think of him? Immediately. Martin Allen, no. Martin Allen's the best, mate. Nah, so he's up there. He shouted telling John Spicer... Do you think people date for... Uh, uh, do you think people date, though, for show managers? Do you think they put it on for the, the punters? Well, do you know what I didn't like? I don't like that. Did you see Klopp fucking raging at the Liverpool fan that came onto the pitch to celebrate with the players? No, I like that with Klopp. I you hate can't when fans do that. Fans like that though, no? no, I don't like that when you do that, because that can fuck you up with him doing that. I like that with Klopp. You've got an agenda ah, against Klopp. Yeah, no, I, I, I told you about the one Martin Allen, his players running through one-on-one, -on -one. I told you, didn't I? 
I was on the bench so so. playing that way no that so that I was on the pitch for that one Spicer we are fucking playing that way <laughs> but I think I got dragged after that it was, either, it was either a different game at Swindon his strikers broke through me so it's like him and the goal was like 20 yards and he turns and he looks at our bench and goes he's gonna fucking miss I know him he, he's shit he's gonna fucking miss <laughs> striker puts it by the post you'd think he'd go fucking mad he looked at us and like why did I fucking tell him <laughs> <laughs> he's done that Keith Hill done that at Rochdale as well once with his oh. striker running through what a hero Matt Mellis oh, uh, he did he do it for the rest of the season uh, bad news yeah. bad news for him kind of sums the season up on it Aye. Aye. Because the start of the season was hard to be uh, get your real opinion on because they had so many players out. Aye. Um, and then you say, wait till they come back, and then they did come back, and then you have gave your opinion on Hearts, who had just the same amount of Aye, there you go, Shy. <laughs> But no, I didn't. Uh, I'm sure you listened none, back. No, no, I'm sure you listened. I would have mentioned that as well. But they have now came back, and you have seen the improvements. Um, and then him, him now to the rest because he's. I think he's probably one of the best players still in the game. See, look at the Hibs' bench at the, the weekend. Strong, it was quite strong at the weekend, right? Very strong. Even though they said... Are they still playing? Are they still... 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 John Collins, what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if on the side of the pitch, wasn't he? I can't, I can't he took remember. took his set-up session on the side of the pitch. So when, when's the next Hibs Hearts game? It must be soon then, is it? Aye, there's definitely, there's one before the split, aye. Could that be the sure. one that decides? I think it is April. Maybe could be a third, third spot to decide, don't I? Fair play to the boys like you, you and Tonic, because McGeady probably was their best player, but he's yep. stepped up since he's... Uh, he gives you a lot of him mm. a hell of a lot Nisbet's back and he came on Saturday I've seen him on the bench uh, he came on the big boy from where's he came from and the other big striker Schalke uh, Kul- Kul- is it Kulish Kulish yeah. Kul- he, he, he's back he's lo- he looks like a player as well he done well before he was injured before he was injured uh, he's a big physical who's presence, back for Fish aye uh, Fish Cabrai Cabraya Fish Cabraya uh, Hanlon and Hanlon Cadden 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 scored because that was the same worry when Portis went win it and I think Rocky Big Rocky's Big Rocky suspended injured. He, he got injured. That's a worry, but it seems like they've done, they've dealt with that really well. Well, I'm not saying it's because Portis is left and the series out, but their defensive record's been the Far biggest better. reason why they're, yeah. they're, they're, mm. they're doing so well. Because they kept like clean sheet Aberdeen, clean sheet Kelly. They've kept like quite a few clean sheets in this one. They've been on. So I'm pretty sure when Paul Hannon was in with Bashiri and Portis, I think he was getting a bit of stick. But that's all muted down there. So yeah. they must be performing quite well, which is good to see because Hibs obviously are a good side. They've got yeah. good players. We've always said that, but. It's getting a run of results together, but now it's showing five points behind fourth, third, sorry, five points behind third and fourth. Can, and, you, uh, can you see a shot there, Kev? Have a few Rangers? Aye. Can you? Can I? Can you? I think the one. <laughs> <laughs> I think the Rangers might nick it by one. <laughs> no, we need to mention as well, but I think Portis is flying, didn't they? Just Just good on Another him. Scottish boy. Good on him. See him being on a couple of team of the weeks. Mate, good fan. talking about boys that are flying, Josh Doig at that Verona is flying. Lewis Ferguson has been linked with all sorts of clubs. Bologna beat, who was it, AC Milan they beat last week? And I'm going to tell you the next one. Boy, Max Johnson at Mullerum. Ah, you're just saying that because he was linked with Union Berlin in the paper. <laughs> Good Mons player. Mons and Union Mons Berlin. Union Berlin. Good, ah, Good player, mate. Is he, aye. Heard, heard big Brilliant to hear that, innit? If I, would, I, I would recommend it. See, another one that's no, it's proper under the radar since he's, but I wait, Liam Henderson's done very well since he went yeah. to see that. What's he he's played, played a lot of games. Aye, he's played a lot of games. He's played, I've seen him at the weekend. He's still at Hibs. He's at Hibs, isn't he? He's played really well, but I mean, he played in he Saturday. Scored a double, what, 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 other a double game, what other game did you see him play well? The one before they played. Who they played? I can't give you a place and don't mind any pivots in that. It was great. <laughs> pivots? Pivots? <laughs> 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 don't mind the pivots. You can bounce back again. Do you know who I love, by the way? Every time I see him, the wee boy Dander at Ross County. Nah, he's a good player. Where did he get him for? Swansea. Oh, how did he manage that? Aye. I think he'd actually played quite a few games at Swansea as well before he came, but. He's really good. Ross County got that oil money, mate. Uh, that, I think he'll be on a few quid there, mate. Fairly getting the types of players up to Ross County, yeah. Do you know who I felt? Ross County have made, that's one thing about Malcolm McKay, he's made some very good signings mm-hmm. since he's been to Ross County. Mm. Rangers have the bill. Uh, Rangers. I'm going for a 1 1 draw. I'm going 2 1. Who turns? Rangers. 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 Paul? Rangers. Comfortable? Ah, I think it will be. 2 2 3 now. Right, right. Right. Look at you, tight jokes at man. By the way, do you know who I felt really bad for uh, what the weekend? Jim Goodwin. I see Peter from coins up and what are you thinking? Somebody said nah, there was a pie get fucked after my row. Didn't it? A, fa- yeah. a pie? Macaroni, man. Wouldn't have chucked a fucking pie at me. I'd have been sitting like that. I do think it's so much. See if that guy ever was anywhere near Jim Goodwin, he fucking shit himself. Do you know what I mean? I know. It's just, uh, I just, there's no need for that at all. Why would you want to go to a football game and do that? Plus, he's no like. 
he didn't do a great job, but he never. Never got to relegate. No, he didn't disrespect anyone. He never. No, like, exactly. He's done his best when it. Somebody says it was Craig Brown that flung the pile. <laughs> 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 Jim Lee, I'll tell you what Listen to get beat So it doesn't matter But Dundee United Were very good The first half <sighs> Stephen Fletcher was Could have had a heart attack Probably couldn't he yeah, first no, That's the thing with, like, Fletcher has been incredible But there have been chances Where I would chances. Know, I would think Fletcher scores that eh? right. But right. again Listen, The one that he absolutely Laced that was going Bottom corner uh, I can't remember it was in, in the uh, and then we, we talk about it I mean there's only so much A manager can do The boy Edwards Has got the complete control Of the ball And I don't, God knows what he does And then you think That's bad enough You think I'll, I'll make it up I'll do it again For the third goal mm. Fuck me it's a, <laughs> Fuck me It's an incredible oh, Finish so I, but I'll, I'll I'll play, man. I ain't choking on anybody In the bus But that Edwards Fuck me man But it just shows you, Edwards has been a good player For United There's a reason why He's made captain It just shows you When your confidence is gone Charlie last week Big Edwards this week, the two of them's had a tough week. Hopefully they'll they'll scratch their heads together and uh, scratch their heads together. <laughs> they'll be better next week. They'll be better they'll be better next week. They'll be better next week. Scratch fucking hell. If in doubt, scratch the fuck. That was clear as mud. I agree. I think uh, the problems that they've been facing uh, last week and um, I think Charlie I think Charlie kicked out of the boys. Face. Remember the keeper came out and not slammed it, but I think at that time it's not. I'm not saying just kick it, but I think at that point don't be fucking about me. Mate, don't see the bus. <laughs> see where my B license right. So there's an. All I'm going to say is it was an ex Aberdeen player, right? That was on my B license, and you're talking about just fucking getting rid of it. So we're then defending the final third, right? Coaching course. So you're supposed to come in and give some coaching tips or something like that. And the team he's working on that's defending is conceding a goal. He stepped in and went. Just get fucking rid of it! Or a B license <laughs> Did he get pulled up for it? No! <laughs> I'd, I'd imagine maybe on the side, but honestly, it was one of the best ah. things I've ever seen. Do you know the worst is when it's somebody asks you, when you see a point about coaching to somebody and they ask you on it and you don't know the answer to it? <sighs> and that's the worst you've ever been in that. But they test you. Are well, you talking about your players when they ask you? No, no, no. It's better uh, than the young boys, but uh, you, you say something, sometimes you, you get a mind blank. Last you year, fucking answer for last it. Last year, that Steen's in the five says, yeah, I've been here since I need bar, mate. It's, uh, it's the first time they've come across anybody at this level playing like two at the back and two up front. <laughs> I hadn't deliberately meant to do that. <laughs> <laughs> I went, aye, I just I like two at the back, I says, because it keeps them tight. I says, and just bring everybody in and just catches on the break. Aye, that's interesting, that. Because everybody just plays the diamond at fives. And that's what you were playing. We were playing that, just like, But by the way, what a finish for Duke. Ah, ah, brilliant, brilliant, mate. Brilliant. Very good. I can't remember the goal. What? Back I oh, fuck. I was outstanding. He's been brilliant, isn't he? Aye. He's good, that big guy. For Aberdeen, he's been really good. Very good. Um, fair, Barry Robson's done a decent job. But I mean, you, Barry, you didn't get that job. Listen, I've in said long term, I mean. If he continues in the, 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 the kind of form they're on, because the games they've lost, the, the part for the, the first one where they're sending off, um, they've done all right, by the way. I think he's done well bringing in the guy. Get well, see eight. on that, Kev, that's what I was going to say to you. So, uh, for me, Aberdeen's recruitment's not been great, but the two centre backs that they've signed have made a massive difference. Mm -hmm. Is that two Barry Robson? Would you think that'd be a Barry Robson? I'd, I'd be surprised because mm -hmm. it was on deadline day and Barry right. Robson got the interim job that day. That day uh, so, surely, he's, surely that was in the pipeline. But I'm thinking that also the boy Agnew. Ah, so that, that English came in, I think he knows that. Ah, usually, usually when, say, in the experience that I've seen in Scottish football or any football, when somebody gets sacked, and they promote somebody up, you usually just stuck with the staff that you're given. But the fact that he got promoted up and was able to bring in Aye. Steve Agnew, that would tell you a lot. Yeah. He can still get fucked. Aye, definitely. Well, see, when you actually look at it, they probably oh. got the most favourable run uh, set, uh, in terms of like that. Oh, we'll need to blur that fixtures. out. I'm sorry, Mick. Is that that you done there? Ah, so, right, so. We'll need to blur that out. Blur that out. Aye, Aye. they've got like some. I think they've got. Is it, is it, how many games are the splits? at six? Six. I think four of them at <clears> home. <throat> I think five of the six games are. Bottom six that are in the bottom six in there, so that's why. Go that's why run. the other end of the table. That's why I worry a bit for command because they'll run to the to the splits. Is it bad? Aye. But can you see Dundee United winning a game? Well, when was the last time they won? Is it? It must old. have been. The, it was the week before. <laughs> the week before they played Hearts. The week before they played Hearts, <clears throat> they beat. Um, and you just hope Goodwin's confidence, isn't it? I've that said it a hundred times, and I've been wrong every time, but I still don't think Dundee United winning. Are you not? I think it's going to be hard for them now. Do you reckon Jim Goodman could get sacked before the season's out and get another fucking Premier League job? <laughs> <laughs> See, I think... Dundee United look to me like they've got players who are regularly making mistakes. Mm -hmm. I think we'll right. stay up. 
I, I've always said I'll not say who I think will go down, but I will I will mm-hmm. die on the hill for now at the end at Dundee next day. Ross County were good. Wow. Ross County were good against Come to the red card. Really good. Again, even that's not a red card. No, kills well, a uh, Ross County's son Van Veen. Mm. It's definitely a foul, of course. It's a, uh, I don't know it's a red card. I, I just changed that game completely. Uh, and what, what did you make of the penalty situation on that one? Mm. The one that Ross County got given and then overturned I It looked as if like it, it, it definitely pulled him to the floor whether it was because like if he pulled him first that it's got overturned I'm not so sure but Aye, it definitely dragged him to the deck I don't think it's a clear novice error mm. so the fact that they've overturned it it needs to be a clear novice error it's overturned because it? he yeah, was like, pulling first that's the reason why wasn't it Aye. he was pulling first but nah Van Veen he, he, he started scoring a few goals which will help him otherwise what's that that's them up to what's it got eight no is that three no six two wins in a draw <laughs> <laughs> two wins I'm trying to calculate the math three, three wins in a draw Quite three a wins in a draw <laughs> so 10 points, 30 points, 6 points ahead of the United. A mother will say. You're brilliant, honestly, you're brilliant. <laughs> the legend. You owe da- you owe Danny Zucco, isn't it? Danny <laughs> fucking Zucco. <laughs> when he goes on ice, see when he goes to go in leather jacket to like the wee bass. That's when, when, remember when Danny Zucco goes to be the nice guy? That is. No Wins a wee bit like Olivia Newton John as well. Aye. That could be the theme of night. Aye. Yeah, he Batman, Batman kept under the covers in it, the night. Me Batman. You don't look Danny Zuko after two weeks on Wild Time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I, I keep asking you to bring me a cannon, you'd never bring it in then. I quite enjoyed it. Do, it's great to see you know, all these people that are buying on Instagram and that, isn't it? No. Flooded my page. Great to flooded. see you flooded. I, I, was just say, I, I bought a box. Wow. Did you, mate? Sums him up. What I generally I'll send you a picture later because I, I I meant to send a picture after I wore it. What a man! Well, I just took a turn, just took an ocean to buy it. I actually think I generally think it's nice, mate. I so you sat, you just sit in the house with a can of wild thing. And but I don't sit with a can. I want I'm going to like twenty strain or something. I take a wee wild thing. I want uh, your missus to 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 do a wee post right on Insta with you and her sitting where we are. Go Andy for fifteen percent. I want to see if his missus put it up and sell it. Hey, she thinks he's Andy. Fact. That's what you need to get that. Hey, there's maybe something you can do for her in return, hey? Very. <laughs> How much she's willing to do for this? She's wanting a bit of the real wild thing, eh? <laughs> nah, don't. Nah, shit. <laughs> <laughs> don't deal with that. Uh, what what in a Ross County Kelly? So you, I think you, I, I know you're not going to say it, but I think you think Kelly will go down. What are you having? You think f- Kelly will go down? I think that's what you think. <laughs> but I think Dundee United. I don't like to say Kelly, and I said it last week, but I still think that, that I'm worried for them. I know you're saying home form, I get that, but I don't know. I just no struggle to see how Dunedin are going to pick up wins. Am I? It always gets to that point. It's when it's when the, it's when the split happens. That's when it's like, what did the United need to do? Is they've got this big game Wednesday night against? Is it Levy? Well, it's obviously not that big a game we don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's Levy. <laughs> I think it's Levy. It's for game in hand. <laughs> right. Oh, so that's why it's a big game, right? Okay. Aye, it's uh-huh. for game in hand. So good yeah. time to play Levy as well, Kev. Nah. I'm thinking that. I'm hoping it's Levy. <laughs> I need to check that. Can somebody please oh, check? Can the monitor board check that? <laughs> I'm just going to check. I think it's for. Is it Levy? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Hey. Hey. Hey, so I think obviously Levy on the ropes. In D United, could they get three points? And that three points could be something to hand. Mm-hmm. Something to build on for Jim. Right, Duke's goal goal season. No. Oh, no, no, I think so. We didn't see that. How brilliant, often do you see brilliant. that? But it's still going to see. What would you rather, a long range oh, or a team goal or something? Team nice. goal, pass, 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 pass. Got somebody open. Fucking somebody's coming uh, in. Bang, bang, bosh. Fucking yeah, goes like bang, bosh. Who's Kyogo? Man, two years out. What is six yard that? Six yard that. That's us. No, it's not. Is it? Nah, we need to cover it. Can I score a fucking unbelievable team goal? No, so long ago. St. Johnson's got about 15 passes or something, aye. 18 passes. Aye. Who played the final one? You. Did you, mate? Did aye, you no, 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 the only one pass. But oh, I remember. Hum- Humpsies has got to be up there for goals. Oh, oh Humpsies. Yeah. Yeah. Aye. That wins it, mate. Weak foot. Aye. See, that's a line of that wins it. I think we've uh, we've got to talk a wee bit more about Man United and Liverpool. And what I will say is, right. Well, that's as good. Carragher and Gary Neville are the best thing that's ever happened to Sky Sports. No, ever happened to football, I think. The two of them are brilliant. That, but the two of them are really good. They're brilliant, aren't they? Uh-huh. Fucking amazing to listen to. Gary he, Neville's brilliant. He was Keane and Keane in the motor. He was a mute at the end. I didn't know say much, did he? Embarrassing. See if I was on Sky and I would say it was Celtic, he's the next man you play, I'm an ex-Celtic player, I'd be harmless to like players. <laughs> Mate, I'd annihilate them. Why? For winning? All right, if that was them. No, that, that, uh, that happened yesterday, I'm saying. You've got Gene Mate, and he's, fucking... He's a captain. Sorry, Bruno Fernandes is the captain. He should have been... I know. He did give him a bit of didn't he? Aye, he did a bit of 
No way. That's what you think is getting a bit. Then. <laughs> it's not what I say is getting a bit. <laughs> Do you like to get Who do you generally think is a better pundit? Uh, Carragher or Neville? Carragher. Carragher's a better pundit, isn't he? Aye. But yeah. Neville, I think Neville's brilliant at like, everything, like talking about things outside football. Yeah, money and finance and But I like Carragher's how he Carragher's sees the game behind. On, on, on Gary Neville's, like, he was con- oh, totally convinced that Man U were going to be He said Liverpool were only good yesterday. Aye, ah, he, nah, he was I totally convinced that. First half, I've only seen the first half. Other people, I thought Liverpool Man, you were good first half, aye. I think the boy Gakpo's going to come. I think he could be a... That's where I think you've got to like, call up, rebuild this team. Because you, ha- you have Firmino's leaving now, Manny left now, so you need to rebuild now, Gakpo's coming in, you know, so you let him rebuild. What do need I really don't want to see Man City get fucking Bellingham, and that is boring, isn't it? He's meant to be in Liverpool, isn't he? Uh, well, you, you'd rather that, because Man U, Man City, man. Although Newcastle could have... Man City will win the league this year. Thanks there you go, I, I think they'll win the league. Who? I think Both. Man City will win the league this well, year. You, you I think Arsenal. Oh, mate, I, I'm sick of Arsenal doing that, mate. 98 minutes, they're just right. not playing them for them to score. What? It's embarrassing for that 98 minutes. The game's done. It's two each of three. Five minutes added on. Uh, 98 but minutes. Five points is nothing in the Premier. Nah. And Arsenal still, 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 still to go Man City and Liverpool away. Yes. What about his uh, Bournemouth goal for a kick-off? Brilliant, mate. Brilliant, mate. Yep. Brilliant. Very good. Never seen that before. Mm. <laughs> I've never seen somebody pass out away before and run to the right. <laughs> <laughs> no, generally, like, he was fucking... It's class. I what enjoyed was it? it. Eight, nine seconds? Eight, nine, nine seconds. seconds. Uh-huh. Have you done it in the nine seconds before? Aye. <laughs> 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 That's an old bad you know that one. Quick question before we go. Capital of dun, 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 Finland. Helsinki. Helsinki, yeah. Well done, Paul. You're too quick at things like that, mate. Very knowledgeable. It's up to yes, you. Um, yeah. Capital of Colombia. Bogota. Well done, Andy. I didn't know that. Well, that's not well done. What's happened to the podcast, mate? They put all the capitals. That's good, that's good, that's good. No, no, and it's sort me and Kev against you, it's two headed things. Aye, after your, um, after what's obviously. I would rather go. Can I say, how can you organise a kid tennis game after a three day bender, mate? Aye, true, aye. Against the most enthusiastic man in the world. Aye, it's. Honestly, mate. Who should have got Bokan Vildi? They're called Aff. Was it uh, <laughs> was it a bad performance or was it. I was playing my mannequin. <laughs> <laughs> you struggling? I can't play with him. No, he was actually better than me. Can't play with him. Fucking brutal, man. Me and you's undefeated, though, Paul. He, mate, he was getting on his point. Me and you's undefeated. Uh-huh. Me and you's undefeated. We've no lost. We've no lost. No, right, me, well, me I, I was part then. of the team that beat fact, Griffiths and Mikey Johnson. Who was my partner then? No, no you, oh, we lost to Boydie with it. So, me and you against you two? Uh, I was two against you two. Oh, fancy. That's a non contest. Oh, we'll win. I'll guarantee you it'll be double wheel 10 5 at least. No chance. Even he said no chance. No chance. Aye, we'll five. Aye, one hundred percent comfortably. No, it's eight. me and Andy against you two. What you two against? Well, you've just said that you hammer and move on. When we did it, when we did it, can we pick the venue? Wherever you want. Where, uh, where do you want to put? You want in a fucking ash pitch or something? Don't date Andy. I'll date you. Then you'd be somewhere else. Boca Dome. No, he wants it in his dad's living room, didn't you? Boca Dome. Sticky flares. Can't move your feet. We're dating our girls for your fantasy. Your treasures, then. Boys, no, no hey, no way, I did fuck, no chance. Movies of the week. It's your favourite movie you watched of the week. I went and watched Ant Man. What? I went and watched Ant Man. Good. Decent. Alright. Mm. Um, Any films you've watched recently update? Today? Uh, it's one of the good TV shows. Somebody, because I'm. Yellowstone's TV. brilliant. I know I, I, it's too slow for me, then. not I? I tell you, that one, me and the, the, the journalist, we went, I think the other day we had dinner with a journalist, and I was so awkward talking to this journalist, and I started asking him about Yellowstone. <laughs> He's, he went for a, we were pick manager when he went for a shite for 30 minutes. Mate, me and this job. Did you just get a, like, a uh, nomination for manager one? No, they take our opinion on. <laughs>